Hello Aquarius and welcome to your timeless reading. In this timeless reading Aquarius we are going to be looking at what blessings are coming forward and also what warnings are coming forward for you because there could just be something in your blind spot that you are not currently seeing that is maybe blocking your blessings. So let's see what is coming up. Divine, what messages of blessings and warnings do you want to give to Aquarius? What messages for Aquarius do you want? Thank you. Do you want Aquarius to take away from this reading? So let me just shuffle these cards a little bit more. And Aquarius, remember to have a look at your sun sign, your moon sign and your ascendant sign. Because by doing so, you get a much fuller picture of the energies that you are working with. And also to take what resonates with you from these readings to leave what doesn't because that will resonate with someone else who's watching this reading because I try to include as much information as possible so not everything is going to resonate just with one person so take what resonates and if it doesn't resonate that message that part of the message is for someone else so let's have a look to see what message is coming up for you Aquarius the message that is coming up for you is all about taking that leap of faith the divine wants you to take a leap of faith, to take a risk and to put your heart's true desire into action. So there could be a feeling that you have wanted to do something for a long time, but for some reason you might be feeling afraid, you might be feeling like I can't do this for whatever reason it is. The divine is here asking you to take that leap of faith. And let's see what the next card was all about. And this card is bringing in an energy of fairness. So there might be a situation that you are currently going through at the moment and the divine wants you to be fair, wants you to be just and to also understand that if you are going through any legal situations at the moment, the divine wants you to know that that situation is going to be dealt with fairly. So if you're worried about not being heard, not being treated fairly, the divine is saying everything is going to be okay. So our next card for you is coming in and bringing in an energy of prosperity. I love this card. So the energy of prosperity is telling you that the divine, the universe is pouring, pouring. Okay, Aquarius, it's abundance out to you. The question is, are you open to receiving? Well, are you? There's a lot of prosperity. There's a lot of abundance that is on the cards for you. You are certainly are blessed. So I want you, if anything, to go in the comment section and to claim these beautiful energies of prosperity that is here for you because you have amazing energies and blessings that you are working with, um, Aquarius. So let's have a look to see what's going on next. All right. So now we have a card that is asking you not to back down. Don't back down. Stand up for what you believe is right. So whatever is going on here, we saw that we had a situation here that was telling you that a situation was going to be dealt with fairly. And not only that, the divine wants you to understand that if you are challenged, speak up. If you are challenged, don't back down. Speak your truth. Because whatever you are saying, as long as you are coming from that energy of speaking truth, as long as you're coming from the energy of being authentic, this situation is going to be dealt with fairly. But stand your ground and don't back down. If someone is putting pressure on you, don't buckle and fall. Stand strong because the divine wants you to know that it is important. This is how that situation is going to be dealt with fairly. If you are not buckling and starting to be afraid and starting to backtrack, stand strong. If it's right to do so, if you are being authentic, then do not back down to anyone, to any situation. So let's have a look to see what our next set of Oracle cards wants you to know. Thank you, Divine. So our next set of Oracle cards has thrown a card, a card out to you. So let's see what is going on. So let's see. So the first card that jumped out for you was coming in, speaking 
about you trusting in higher forces. You are the shaman. You are trusting in the divine. You are understanding that the divine is more wise. The divine sees more than you do. So again, even though you are not backing down, you're standing strong. You might be feeling worried about speaking your truth. You might be feeling worried about showing up authentically. You might be feeling worried about whatever is going on. So the divine is saying, don't worry. Everything is going to be dealt with fairly and to trust that the divine is protecting you to trust in higher forces. So don't be in an energy of worrying about anything. The next card, we have the stargazer. And the stargazer is asking you to set your sights high. We saw you here taking a leap of faith. The divine asking you to not be afraid, jump, take a risk, take a chance. And as you are taking a risk and a chance, we see you here, having already set your sights high. You are jumping and touching the sky. And our next oracle card is giving a high five, a thumbs up to the take a leap of faith card. So the next card we have for you is another card that is speaking about trusting your intuition, trusting in higher forces. We're seeing you now as the high priestess, harnessing mystic forces, mystic powers, harnessing and understanding that you are working with your intuition. So we saw you here being asked to trust in higher forces. We saw you here being the shaman, being in that energy of understanding that the divine can see more than you can. And if the divine can see this situation more than you can, the divine is going to give you intuition, messages, downloads, what to do next, where to go next. And as you are harnessing and tuning in to the intuitive messages that you're getting, tuning in and fine tuning those mystical powers, you are going to see that the divine is going to start speaking to you more and more and more. Perhaps, let's say you are in court, right? Because we saw these two cards here talking about fairness, talking about you not backing down. Perhaps you are going through a tribunal. Perhaps there is just a situation where you are stepping forward and being put under the spotlight. The divine telling you that everything is going to be okay because whatever happened here is going to be dealt with fairly. And then we are seeing you here showing up, not backing down. And as you are doing that, maybe, like I said, you are in court and you are afraid to speak your truth. And as you are real realizing that you are the high priestess. You are then tapping in to your mystical powers, to the powers here that the divine has gifted you. And suddenly, boom, you are able to open your mouth and deliver truth, cutting to the chase. You are delivering a message that everyone is amazed at how you are able to articulate so yourself so well, how you are able to have such a strong presence there is just a presence around you that is mystical, that has an air of awe. And people will look at you and think, wow, we have never seen you like this before. You are appearing like the divine goddess, that masculine type of energy that is the divine masculine energy. You are working with both energies. You are mystical, you are powerful, and you are not backing down. And so the divine wants you to understand that higher forces, higher powers are going to be working with you. So not to be afraid of anything. Let's get another card from our monology cards and see what else the divine wants you to know. Aquarius, the divine wants you to also know that. Wow. All right. Bear with me. We have too many cards. Let's reshuffle our cards and get a clearer message for you. Thank you. So we have your card that has jumped out for you and the card, the message that is coming through loud and clear for you is telling you that communication is the key. So whatever is going on here, this situation that you have going on here, 
a situation that you are told not to back down from, that you are told to stand your ground. Whatever is going on here, this situation is getting resolved through communicating clearly, authentically, powerfully, truthfully. So whatever is happening, happening here, to close off this message, the divine wants you to understand, the divine wants you to know that communication is going to be the key that sees this situation coming out to a successful end. And so this is the reading that I have for you. And Aquarius, if you like love readings, I've got a new channel that I've started. I've linked it in the description box below, a channel that deals with love, relationship, relationships, and all that good stuff. This is the reading that I have for you. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. I'll see you soon. It's a goodbye.